That's a very good question. If you ever attend one of my seminars, you're going to hear me talk about a recipe for resistance weld. Recipe is no different than making a biscuit. If we want to make a resistance weld, we have to have a certain number of ingredients in the correct proportion if we want each weld to turn out with perfection, just as if we're making biscuits. We've got certain ingredients that have to go in in certain proportions to make that biscuit a good biscuit. So in our resistance weld, we got four ingredients that we're going to deal with. Force, current, time, and temperature. Each one of those is an ingredient that goes into making that resistance weld. Once we start that weld process, we can't go back and change those ingredients. So we have to make sure those ingredients are correct every time that we go to make a resistance weld. Force, current, time, and temperature. That's our four ingredients.